This is a walkthrough video of 2738 White Sands. We're located in Gulf Gate, basically just off Seagate. Um, very central Gulf Gate. It's, um, this is a pool home. Looks like there's been some roof repair. I'm not going to say it's the most attractive house. Uh, you know, with this thing that bumps out with the columns. It's interesting, but it... Let's take a look inside before I pass judgment. So I have big living area here with the laminate flooring. I do like the kind of curvature in that hallway there. That's kind of cool. In fact, I'm going to come check out the kitchen. We do have some new windows, which I always appreciate. Eight foot ceilings. Um, hmm. We have a kind of a galley style kitchen. It has white cabinets of white appliances, and for mica, it is pretty spacious, but it's it's just okay. The flooring out here, I, I, this is really weird. I think I am pretty sure that this was the uh, lanai at one point. We have an AC built in the wall. We do have AC ducts out here, and so this has been enclosed into air-conditioned space. We do have vinyl windows, and we also have a naughty panel. I'll tell you, these, this panel does not look like this panel will pass inspect. It's a Zinsco panel. I can see a, a panel replacement in the near future. Yeah, Zinsco panels are no longer insurable. So that's a, when any, anytime you see a Zinsco panel, that's got to go. We have a laundry room. Water heater looks brand new, which I like. And then we have a garbage, uh, garbage. We have a garage. And the AC is brand new. I like that. New AC, new new water heater, but it needs a panel. The house has been replumbed, and I can tell that in a lot of these houses because these these PVC pipes that go up. Originally, the pipes went down through the slab, and uh, eventually, you do have to repipe these homes. So now I'm going to walk over to the actual lanai. Just two ceiling fans out here. A little screened-in area. A brick pattern out here. Is that real? I think it is. No, it's not. And I didn't think so. And so it's kind of a faux brick, which is interesting. It's fenced in backyard, which is nice. Not much shade. We have a pool, but no, no screen around it. These doors, check out these doors. These doors actually pocket into the wall, which is very interesting in both directions. So this does open all the way up. That's interesting that those doors do pocket all the way in. So that's kind of that's actually pretty cool. I I almost want to do it just just if I can figure out how to do the latch. <clears throat> but having those big pocket sliders is actually pretty nice. Nice feature there. Okay, <clears throat> so now I'm taking this curved hallway. And I have a little linen closet, and this is the master bedroom. The master bedroom has a walk-in closet <coughs> with some shelves. We have a bathroom, which is nice. <coughs> Excuse me. It's a pretty small shower. The tile goes all the way up, <coughs> and this walks out onto the walks out onto this <coughs> screen lanai. <coughs> Excuse me, I got a cough here. Excuse me. <coughs> Something in here. So um, the bathroom here this is a guest bath, probably original tile, pretty funky. So this is really only a two bedroom, and uh, but I do like the windows. If I haven't mentioned that already, I do like the windows. And um, so we got two bedrooms over here. One of them's a master. And what more can I say? This is a Gulf Gate, pretty standard Gulf Gate home. It's got a pool and a decent lot. I'm Jules Roman with Yorkshire International, 941-366-0000. And as always, thanks for watching.